My name's Michael Tang, and I'm a partner at Deloitte. I lead our global financial services industry, digital transformation and innovation practice. The concept of the cloud is gonna be game changing because of the COVID pandemic. It's really shifting the conversation of what cloud is from a technology or an infrastructure to the agenda and discussion items at a C-suite or boardroom level. If you think about the lenses of above the line and below the line, below the line conversations around cloud is obviously around scalability, providing security, and obviously around operations resilience. But what COVID's allowed us to look at in terms of the cloud is what I call above the line, new business frontiers, allowing an organization to synchronize the data across finance, risk, customer, product, pricing, and really look at data a different way to make quicker decisions. I think it's provided a platform around agility and velocity to introduce new products. And it's definitely brought out new talent in the organization. There's definitely been a surge in digital traffic. If I start off with the branch, meaning it's a physical place, it's obviously next to zero. But when we take a look at some research conducted by the ICC, which is the International Chamber of Commerce, as well as uh, similar web, we're finding that actual online mobile is almost flat. Uh, internet online banking has gone up anywhere between 20 to 30%, depending on what region in the world. And what's uh, probably really surprising in terms of contact center volume has gone up north of triple digits. A lot of uh, the customers are actually waiting between four to six hours at times. And it's indicative of all the government stimulus policies, the government deferral programs and relief programs. And a lot of customers are actually calling into the contact center. When you combine data with artificial intelligence, machine learning, as well as the computing power of cloud being able to amalgamate massive data sets, you're going to get into really interesting models in terms of how you basically lower the cost of prediction, whether they're around credit risk modeling, loan loss ratios, calculating liquidity in hours versus days or weeks is going to be a big, big differentiator in terms of how AI and machine learning impact financial services. Ultimately, the organizations that are going to come out of post-COVID is getting into CCAI, the contact center AI. Imagine a scenario where you don't need physical bodies that are linearly scaling to your contact center volumes, but you're firing up new agents through AI whenever someone's in a queue and you'll be able to do this in multiple languages. I think that's the destination we want to get to.